But we also want to check out what's happening tonight at OMSI. They're combining two great things, science and toys. And of course, that is where McKinsey is right now for OMSI After Dark. Hey, McKinsey. Hey, what is Cassie, happening yes. over there? Oh, it's a packed house here at OMSI. People are making their own ice cream. Look who just showed up. What? It's Blaze. You never know <laughs> what's going to happen here at OMSI After Dark. He's just hanging out, chilling with us, and we are loving every second of it. Luva joins us now, VP of Development here at OMSI. So what is so special about tonight's OMSI After Dark? So tonight's OMSI After Dark is all about uh, sugar and spice. So we have all kinds of Christmas-related stuff. Delicious things to taste, delicious things to drink, and tonight is also a special night because we have the KGW Toy Drive here in Wells Fargo, who's obviously supporting OMSI and the K KGW Toy Drive, so it's a really special night. Yes, and what can you do if you go to the science store in particular? So at the science store, since it's a toy drive, you can come down here, go to the science store, and buy a toy for the toy drive and you will get a discount. Easy as that, just drop it on off. Matt here, he is a scientist and he has helped develop this special pill. What does this thing do? Okay, so if you guys each want to grab one and put it in your mouth, the little red pill. Now normally we wouldn't just agree to this, but yeah. <laughs> Tracy Curtis, she's still hanging with us from Wells Fargo, okay. All right, put it in your mouth. You want to swish it around. You might have to chew it in a minute. Make sure you coat all over your tongue. Because what's happening is that this pill is derived from a berry called a miracle berry. And the miracle berry has a special glycoprotein in it called miracolin. And what it does is it basically bonds with the sweet taste buds on your tongue, the sweet receptors on your tongue. And it sticks to them and it responds to acid. So things that are usually really sour are now going to be stimulated by this. Uh, the, the acids in the sour food are going to stimulate this and change the proteins on your tongue creating a really sweet sensation. So go ahead. And How long did like this take lemon. to create, Matt? Oh, I don't know. I, I came up with the demo. I, I, I adapted this experiment, but the pills, I think... Uh, okay, so we take a citrus a first. Well, whatever you want. Yeah. Okay. So try a lemon's good or a lime. So just go ahead and lick, lick it maybe first. Just see how it tastes. Oh, Ooh, it's intensified. Mm, good. Yeah, it tastes like candy, right? It does. Yeah, and so you can actually just like eat a lime or eat a lemon. Um, yeah. So what will happen if we try something sweet now? Yeah, try something like a, a, a sour candy. Um, the sweetness isn't going to be any different. It might actually be even a little duller because your sweet taste buds are a little blocked. But the sourness of it should just totally be eliminated and should just taste really sweet. This could help cure my sweet tooth. <laughs> I'll just want citrus. I like that a lot. So cool. Very nice. Well, come down OMSI After Dark. Tickets still available. And, of course, they're supporting our fabulous KGW Great Toy Drive. Thank you very much. Yeah, thank you. And Blaze, oh, we lost him. He's in the mix making his own ice cream. Cassidy, I'll bring one of these back for you. You have to try this. It's I have. Pretty so amazing. I have actually back tried you, that girl. for a YouTube video yeah. once. It was crazy. I was eating so many salt and vinegar potato chips. It was awesome. <laughs> so much fun. Thank you, McKinsey. <laughs>